slow speed up to get your flight. Push a little grease out. Like Welcome to my crazy life as a first generation female farmer, the Chronicles of Kayla. <laughs> I'll see you guys in the buddy seat. Good morning. Happy Wednesday. It's a working Wednesday around here. Uh, Boo, you're fine. We have some special guests coming to the farm today. As soon as they get down there, they might already be there. I don't know. Chase is down there. So, um, special friends coming. Philip eyes me while I'm at it. Um, so, we'll get down there. You guys seen in the video from yesterday that the new mower conditioner 1393 it came in from Loth. That's one of five new pieces of equipment we're gonna have running around this season. Um, not all massy, obviously, but uh, one of several pieces of new stuff happening. Ryder, honey, you're driving me nuts. I'm gonna make a protein shake this morning and get out the door. Come on, baby. Yeah, everybody wants some attention from mom because I've been working and uh, I haven't been home a whole lot lately because I've been working. This one's a blender. Is this one a blender cup top? Breakfast on the run, collagen for my bones. Protein. This is quick and easy. Um, don't judge me. Yes, I can eat, but at this point in the game, it's a lot easier to sip and uh, be on my day. Yeah, I think this is all I need at the moment. Okay, let's get on the walk. How did I go down here? Well, they're not even in any massy attire. We don't know who they are. <laughs> Not even a labeled truck or anything. No, Just no. sneaking in. Yeah. Yeah, we do that. So. We <laughs> <laughs> don't know who we are. We get Yes. Yeah, all right. So you guys want to explain what you guys are here to do today, and your names? <laughs> okay. Uh, I'm, I'm Lucas Mitchell. I work for Smart Ag Agco. We're here to put on a Simply Bell harness and kit for the 1842S. Say so that we've already had this for the 1840 and 44 options. We're now bringing it to the 1842S. This gives you the, the large square features on your small square bell, is our kind of key phrase we like to say with it. So that's, that's about the basics of it. Are you excited? <laughs> yes, very. <laughs> but mostly for you, because um, it would make my life a lot easier. So. That's for sure. Oh yeah, <clears throat> yeah. In cab so. adjustability, no more getting out. Yep. Checking bells as much. Easy. Where you no are. more tape measure. It's funny because, uh, like, I have like a pretty good friend of mine and lives about four miles from here. His uh -huh. name's Luke Mitchell. Really? Yeah. That's <laughs> crazy. That's so. funny. That yep. is. I did, it didn't so. like dawn on to me until just now. Yep, so. <laughs> yep, sure is. Thank you. 
contrary to what Jason thinks, I work quite a bit. Um, actually, I've like uploaded, imported, it would be the better word, imported like every piece of footage until this moment on my computer. It's all in the editing site. And uh, I'm trying to load a video right now, but I don't know if it'll go by the time I get back or not. Sometimes it's kind of contrary. So I brought the computer home to charge. Check the, ma check the mailbox while we're here. Oh, I got packages! I have packages! Well, let's see what we got. Bill, Bill. Okay. Oh. What did we get? Oh, we got something exciting. We'll have to open it when we get out of the middle of the road here, okay? Hold on. I don't hit the mailbox. Um, Jason is with the guys from Simply E System. Um, they're working on the baler. I've been editing and uploading and working on my blog, trying to get everything situated and nice and tidy. I am now running parts because we fought with the skid loader last night. It's got some sort of, it's got a problem. Um, after four hours of dicking around with it, we I think we found the problem last night. So, Gotta go run and get that part, pick up a more, couple more tires for the skid, um, make a hose, and then come back. And I'd really like to take a nap if we were being bluntly honest, but I don't know if that'll happen. Um, also, also, um, go please check out uh, my friend Jesse. She has these awesome tees. They're super soft, super great. Um, so God made a farmer, a rancher, a mama, all these different um, cute little sayings with Bible verses on it. And I will link her webpage down below. But she's one that I met and connected with and groomed with when I went to Rural Rooted a couple years ago. And her and I have become social media friends because uh, she is actually in Montana so she, it's not like she's real close to visit with but super enjoy her stuff she has a blog as well and a newsletter and it's like beyond the fence lines so she's just doing her thing as a rancher out there isolated you know I think their closest town and maybe an hour away I could be wrong but uh, you know how I feel about supporting local and uh, yeah, so make sure you check her out. I'm gonna buzz to Mexico and I will see you in a bit. This little spiel we gave at the show, just your basic, basic home screen. It's it. All these are configurable to kind of different categories that you want. So the top one is what we call those driving lights. So each one of these will update with your flake. So every time you make a new flake, this will update. Red <clears throat> means you're going too slow, flake's mm -hmm. too small. Green, or no, sorry, said that backwards. Red's too big, you're going too fast, slow down. Green below the center line, you're going too slow, speed up to get your flake okay. count. Flakes per bale, this will be your current, and then your last bale. Okay. Same with your overall bale length <clears throat> right here. This is the size. This will update every flake. Bells per hour. This one. Moisture, if that's enabled. I think that's all of them. Yeah. That's all. And then down at the bottom, it'll have your. If you have decompress, if you're running uh, chamber decompress, that'll highlight. Mm -hmm. If the lube's running, that'll highlight. And then if your lights are on, it's. Whoa, shown. look how bright. It'll turn you green. have green there too. Okay. The lights, so. okay. That sort of thing. <clears throat> That's and like totals there. Yeah. So this is your kind of field stats. These are all resettable. Do the hold. The bar goes across. You can reset. So this is this. We put this in here to remind people for their service. So <clears throat> every hundred hours, 
this will go up to 100, and you can look and be like, okay, it's time to lube things every mm -hmm. 100 hours. Bales in the field, resettable. Calculators, these are new. I think these are multiple fields. So if you move from one field, this is like the whole day, you can program it to yeah. only do field one, two, if you're That's going nice. to different ones. Okay. And then your average moisture. Cool. So like on bale count, can you send them to a cloud or anything? No, no. it's all okay. on here right now. Okay. You can't take anything off okay. right now. This is the uh, density pressure screen. So these three options right here give you, these two options are your two available. So manual voltage, this is if you don't have the density like you all will. This, this is where you'll set your pressure okay. right here. So I'm not back there anymore? Nope. Okay. No, I'll set right here. Okay. And then if you had the scale, we have that third option that'll auto density based off bail weight. Moisture screen. Here's kind of your bail summary. So this is where you're putting in your target flake count. Mm -hmm. This will be, <clears throat> so this is, we try to make sure we get this clear. This is what you put this number in for what you measure. Okay. Because you're not electrically adjusting it. Right. So you'll set it manually like you have in the past, measure that bale, then put that number in here so our software knows mm -hmm. what you're actually getting. Right. And then it <clears throat> goes from here. Fan auto reverse. Mm -hmm. All these are you know, changeable. changeable. Yep. That's the auto lube we were talking about. Okay. Every 50 bales, it'll run for 10 seconds mm -hmm. up and down. And then another little service screen to reset. <clears throat> and then your... Last one is your max density pressure. Okay. So it won't go over. The next screen, these are just settings, settings for, the, for the screen, brightness, English, sound. We wish it was louder. It's not super loud, so the beeps. This is great for when you're servicing or you've got an issue and you're trying to figure some things out. So as things come on and off, it'll highlight the button. So if your fan's running, that'll go. If your needles are in the home position, which this should be lit up right now, we need to adjust that sensor. It'll be green, all these sort of things. So if you're having errors, you can come here and be like, well, my fan is running the right way. My needles are home, why am I getting this error? Shows your speed output, those sort of things here. Okay. Turn things on and off based mm -hmm. on the baler you have, all on this screen. Errors, this is, this will take you to our access page. I think this uh, QR code, that's where you got like our operator's manual, mm -hmm. installation guide, if you want to do look at some different things all there. And then software updates is all right okay. here. You'll scan that. <clears throat> this thing produces its own little Wi-Fi. You'll stand here with your phone, connect. You'll know if there's, I think you download the new software from the access website to your phone, or it might already be on the app. Okay. Stand here, it takes about five minutes and then and across the top, you can you can play with these. So you can set certain things you want to see up here. So if you have this screen right here, moisture will come up on there mm -hmm. too. Yep. And all these you can put what Change you them. want. Change them. Okay, okay, okay. Cool. All so right. yeah, you'll figure out, I want this at the top because this is what I like to see. My flakes per bale or overall bale length. Then I want to see flakes, my moisture, yep. each flake okay. size. There's five of them here that yep. you can put Okay. however you want them. Okay. And that's just your overall like and then I think or bales, bales, bales down sorry, there. Yep, yeah, yep, bales. Yep. this down here <clears throat> is lifetime so you okay. can't change these numbers okay. that's fine these will stay forever with this on this baler hours and bales gotcha that's okay. kind of nice yeah so that's the basis rundown of the thing all of it configurable you can change these we always keep this one as the home so if you ever get off the home screen that one stays okay and then yeah just it's nice rugged yep that's that's pretty much the basics of it we got oops light and dark mode just some different things people have asked for and it's polarized so polarized sunglasses you can wear them first ones we they didn't right. they forgot about that part with the glass so. yep you had to your head yeah, you had to turn sideways or not wear your sunglasses too. Uh, See, you're the only one. Well, you and Keaton wear your glasses. I, yeah. I don't. Yeah. Well, yeah, that's that's the basis of it. We'll go through.
Yeah, it's meant to go on any machine we got. Gotcha. So like, okay. The LSBs, the new ones, they got two or three CAN buses, so we mm -hmm. can look at each one. Gotcha. Yeah. That's why it's got so much extra, it's just universal. Right. So how's that thing, How how's this all? You can probably just stuff a lot of this stuff in here. Yeah, that's what we're going to do. Yeah. yeah. And Try to hide clean, it. That'll best clean it up can. pretty good. So when you put that cover on. That's a bar. Do that have a bottom? No. No, no, no bottom. No. Like that. And then, because then you won't have, let's see, then you could still have your big square here, but you have nothing up here. Well, I can't have anything in the window because. Huh? Well, no, I'm saying the big squares go here, like yeah. you did last year, and then you just have here. You don't have, yeah, you don't I don't, have your camera I wouldn't, here. Yeah, I don't want anything up there because, like, you set high enough, I do not, where sometimes I get a little bit worried pulling out, you know. We can go there. Then you can still get all to all your buttons. I also need to, we need to make some sort of mount for my camera in here. But I also wouldn't mind having some sort of, and it can be maybe off the door. I don't know. I'd like to have my iPad in here to keep track of data. Is there a RAM mount over here? So this is the Simply Bell kit for the 1842S. This is a prototype special to here to Kayla and her to use on this unit. The 40 and the 44 are available to order today, and hopefully this will be available soon. Well, we appreciate you guys coming and getting yes. us ready for hay season, and It'll be here before we know it. we're ready. We're Absolutely. one step closer to being ready. Thank you, guys. Yeah, no problem. Thank you. you yeah. Push a little of the grease out, let the lube go in. And... Oh, yeah. I thought you said it was the owner's name or something like that. Because they weren't on there. It's like Christmas. Yeah. Oh, no, pick up.